hi my loves welcome back to my channel i'm c slays and for today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i achieved this gorgeous fall glam makeup look um so make sure if you like this video be sure to like comment and subscribe and yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get into it so let's get started so of course i do my eyebrows off camera um there's a tutorial of how i do my eyebrows already on my channel and now I'm gonna go ahead into the matte book by the crayon case super gorgeous I love this palette and I'm going to be starting with the first the first layer of brown shades and now I'm just showing you guys how I'm going to you know lightly pack that onto my lid and now I am lightly packing that first brown shade onto the lid of my other eye just blending, blending, blending. Now I'm going to go into the next brown shade and I'm going to pack that on top of the color that I just packed onto my lid. And we're trying to make like, you know, a little, a little gradient effect, okay? I'm gonna go into the orange shade and I'm gonna put that right underneath my eyebrow so that way it can act a little bit like a transition shade now you want to go in very lightly please lightly with this orange okay um, because yeah it's supposed to be you know a little neutral it's supposed to be you know like light we don't want it like BAM it's orange okay so just be really gentle when being close underneath your eyebrow now I'm going on ahead and adding that orange to the um, other eye blending 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 and hopefully you guys can start to see um, the gradient Now I'm going into the Afrique palette by Juvia's Place and I'm going to go ahead into the um, brown, the dark brown shade and I'm going to put that at the lowest point of my eye, like my eyelid, just so we can give the look a little more um, like depth. I was confused. Okay, now I'm going in with the gold shade in the Afrique palette. Um, and just putting that into my inner corners as like some highlight and I love gold so I be packing a whole lot of shade into my um, inner corners because we like to glow okay so now I'm gonna be putting that gold shade underneath my like my at my brow bone and just you know packing that on there for the glow period now I'm gonna go into make a wing with my NYX eyeliner um, usually I do my eyeliner off camera but for some reason I was like let me try to show y'all so this first side came out a little I was struggling a little bit it was a little questionable but you know you just can't give up you gotta be persistent so usually I draw the lines and then I fill it in um, now I just trying to sharpen it up see not too bad not too bad and honestly if you guys ever mess up your wing liner you can go ahead and take a flat brush and just clean it up with some concealer and now this eye boom line we're gonna go ahead and connect it bam period that was sharp now just going on ahead and filling it in see you just got to jump into your wings with confidence okay Okay, now we have 
two wings. Okay, now I'm just going on ahead and cleaning up um, the wings. Sometimes I like hold my lash down and I make sure I get it all, you know, lined up. Nice, now I'm going back into the Afrique palette with this gold shade and I'm adding more to my inner corners because I like to glow, I love to glow. Like, cause when the sun hits, it's just gonna be like, bam. Like, okay, now adding some more to my brow bone. Now adding some, well applying some mascara. Just so that way when we put our lashes on, everything looks seamless. crazy nothing too difficult and bam this is how she looks when she has lashes on okay I was really excited y'all I was really really excited now we are moving on to this face so I'm gonna go ahead in with my milk primer getting that all up and through my skin make sure you get under your eyes your cheeks you want to prime up everything okay now going in with my Maybelline you know fit me foundation everything I use will be in the description box below um, and you know you got to blend that foundation out girl like so now you just see me blending and blending and blending And yes, just, just gotta keep blending, okay? Like we want our foundation to be smooth, we want it to be seamless, so take your time. And now going in with my LA Pro Girl Concealer in the color Toffee, I am highlighting underneath my eyes, and now I'm going back in with the shade Warm Sand to highlight a little more, to start, you know, start a little contour. So I'm doing some triangles underneath my eyes and I'm going to do a little triangle at my chin. And I'm also going to use this shade to put the line for the contour of my nose, as you can see. Now using my Fenty Beauty Matchsticks, I'm going to go in with the color Espresso and I'm going to start to carve out this face. Now listen y'all, like, I am gonna learn how to snatch my skin, okay? Like, I'm talking contour, I'm talking nose, like, getting everything to be flawless and seamless. I'm about to learn, and we're gonna learn together, and we're gonna grow together, because I feel like that's the next steps, you know? Um, now going back into the Afrique palette, using that dark brown shade, I am just attempting to snatch up this nose, okay? Now this is absolutely not necessary, like you really don't have to do this, but this was something that I wanted to try, that I want to start to try doing, so I went ahead and included it. I'm also carving out my nose with that Fenty Match Stick in the shade Espresso, and boom, look at the material, okay? Look at the cheekbones, look at the highlight, look at the shape, okay? Wow, we love it. Now just about to blend okay blend for dear life literally just blending for dear life just keep blending and blending and blending Look at the material, you guys. Left, right, period. Okay. Had 
had to give y'all, had to do a double take in case y'all, y'all, y'all missed it. You didn't see. Wow, something so fall-like, so simple, so pretty. Now going on ahead and doing my lips. Honestly, I just took a regular brown pencil. Could be a brow pencil, lip liner. And I'm just going to go ahead and outline the shape of my lips. And I wanted my line to be really like distinct. Now I'm going in with my favorite chocolate um, matte lipstick. Honestly, I got this from the front of the beauty supply store. Like nothing, nothing crazy. And now, little hack, sometimes when I want to do like a nude lip, I use my LA Pro Girl concealers to help me create like a little ombre nude lip situation. So now just blending that. I went back in with my Choco Craze lipstick just to even out the blend a little bit. And now just going in with my lip gloss, my clear lip gloss to put on top. Now going back to the Afrique palette by Juvia's Place going back into that gold highlighter shade and we gonna highlight the cheeks okay bam y'all see the glow y'all see it like I don't even have to explain to y'all because it's clear it's evident wow make sure you you know you throw a little on the temples a little on the nose, a lot on the cheeks, not a lot, don't go crazy, y'all know what I mean. And now, throwing on some setting spray, and this is the final look you guys. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching. Um, if you like what you saw, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.